Hey guys, and welcome back to Darksiders. We're progressing through the later areas of the Twilight Cathedral. And lift that up. Okay. Ooh, a chest! No, 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 no. Oh, you dicks. Alright, fine. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. Whatever. So, there's two chests in this room, and they both disappear, so... Gotta fight the enemies. Gotta fight the angel. Or beat the angel, not fight the angel. My bad. It's been a long time since I've uh, heard that song. And I've also... It's also been a long time since I looked it up. <laughs> it's a great song, but, you know. Yay! Wow, that's it? What, what was the point of that? Why even throw those guys at me? Ugh. Okay. So, key. And over there, we got a wrath shard. So... Bam! Wow, man. War can teleport when he wants to pick up an item. <laughs> Alright, uh, is there anything over here? No, doesn't look like it. Alright, well, that's it for that. Okay, so, we got the Beholder key, and now we need to go back this way, if I remember right. So, let's go ahead and do this. Woo! I think this is it. Uh, no, that's not it. Okay. Uh, oh, it's that one. My bad. Okay, so we need to go over here, and there's a door that was locked. Oh, wait, no, it's not even this. God damn it. Oh, it's this one. God, I thought it was, like, never mind. <laughs> I gotta pick every other door. If I just went the other way, I would have found it. Jeez. All right, well, uh, jump down this way. It's a little bit quicker. Uh, there we go. Come on. How do I fail at pressing one, two? One, two. Alright. You know when that, remember when that used to be popular? And like, funny? Now it's not. Well, at least I don't think it's funny anymore. Boom! Ooh! Ah! Come on, do the delay. There we go. Okay, so. Stab. Nice. Okay, so open that, and let's go in. Oh, yeah, this. Ugh. Okay, kill you. Take care of all the fire bats in here. Are there any fire bats in Pokemon? I know there's a psychic bat, a poison bat. Um, I don't remember. I don't think there is. Not that I remember, anyway. Okay, so kill the bat. Damn it. I thought I was close enough. Oh, well, maybe I should just always air on the side of caution when jumping over lava. There we go. Come on. There we go. Yeah, sometimes when you got the, a weird angle on these walls, war is a little bit unresponsive. Just a teensy bit. But okay. That's important. Um, well, actually, do I just need to use it right now? Yeah, yeah, I do, because I gotta raise a platform. That's right. Even though that does nothing for me right now, because, well, I can't reach it. It's all the way over there. So, what we need to do is go this way. Oh, yes, I love this room. I love this fight. It's awesome. And hey, look who it is. The guy from the trailer. The Jailer. This guy's cool. Okay. So, he's a big, big man with a cage. So, all you need to do is hit the four things with the crossblade, the four, like, little glowing yellow pustules. And now you'll see where they are clearly, because they turn red when he goes into rage mode. So, hit them all with the thingy. And, oh my god, no! Okay. So, when you not when you hit them, you can see this little green guy come out of this like chest. You want to hit him. Not not the rest of the body, just the little green guy. Ooh! Now you can go for the ads if you want, but every time you attack the every time you hit the green guy, uh, he'll spawn new ones. So there's not a whole ton of point in going for them. So I say just ignore them unless they're a legitimate issue with you. But yeah. I say just ignore them. Boom. That ought to be it. Um, okay, it's not. Wow. I thought it would be. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Eh, bye now. Boom. 
<laughs> I just killed them with that. That was awesome. <laughs> I like how he tries to restart the Jailer's heart. That's hilarious. Or like his other body or whatever. It's weird. It's a very strange enemy, but it's awesome. I love the fight and I love the finisher to death. And their bodies are still here for some reason. I don't know why. Okay. So if you need it, you can go ahead and grab the health chest, but I'm not going to because I'm super MLG. And I'm just amazing like that. I'm so cool. All right, now, let's go ahead and go down. All right. Okay. So this is the only other room in the game that I am aware of that has a hidden chest in it. So yeah. Now I'm sure there's more, but it's the only other one that I know of. So yeah. Maybe I'm just dumb, I don't know. But yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Crossblade, boom, boom, boom. Okay, that's that. Now let's go ahead and light this one. Good. Okay. So now, uh, let's go and light that one and that one. And for now, that's really all I can do. So, uh, I'm going to go and light those, do that, blah, blah, blah. Okay. And do that. All right. Come on at me. You might know. You might. Uh, hang on. Throw it. There we go. Good. <laughs> hey, bitches, guess what? We're gonna die. Boom. <laughs> Woo. Oh, come on. Blow him up. What? Come on. I'm trying to blow up the bomb on him here. Wait, let's do this. Wow, he's infected. What the hell? I didn't know these guys could infect other enemies. That's crazy. Get away from me, man. There. Let's just cover him in bombs. How about that? God, I wish the screen would stop, like, blurring like that. It's weird. Why are you not detonating? Whatever. I'm done horsing around. Let's kill him. Boom. Get out of here. Um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Rip it off. <laughs> That was pretty funny. Now the bombs are just rolling all over the place. That's great. All right. Kaboom. Apparently, I'm not a super MLG pro as I thought I was. So, yeah. And, well, I guess it doesn't really matter because I do end up needing another bomb at the end of the hallway. So, there we go. <laughs> I'll just grab them and put them both on there. Why not? Sure. See, I'm trying to have fun, make it interesting, like I was going to blow them all up. But, no. It just had to be a dick. Wait, did I light this one? Uh, yes. Okay. Because basically, um, in true Zelda fashion, uh, in order to get the hidden chest in here, you gotta light all the torches. That's it. That's all there is to it. Okay. So jump over here. Okay. So raise this up, and it will raise a platform out of the lava. So there we go. And do that, and that, and that, and then that. One, two, three, four. Boom! Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Yay. Alright, let's go ahead and grab that real quick, because this is actually a very helpful one. I believe it's called, I believe it's Bloodthirst. Let's see. It is Bloodthirst. Yes, I knew it. This enhancement heals war by stealing the life of adversaries during combat. Very, very helpful. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put it on Chaos Eater. So, yeah. Uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and take... Um, 
Take Bane off Chaos Eater and then put it on the Scythe. How about that? So, now my attacks with Chaos Eater will heal me. Uh, something that's worth noting, only the weapon that has this thing equipped will uh, actually steal health. So you need to remember that. You need to remember that the only weapon, the only way you'll actually steal life is by using the weapon that has Bloodthirst equipped on it. And you'll know it by, you know, the green. And also, it doesn't actually heal you for all that much. Damn it. The hell. Don't do that. It's cheating. You can't poison me. One of the four horsemen. Shouldn't I be, like, immune to poison? I guess it is, like, a maybe a zombie plague or something, but still. Kind of dumb. Come on! Now, like, do the damn delay attack. Like, I just want to do the whirlwind combo. That's it. All right, there we go. Now I'm going to grab the health on the way out because I took a lot of damage there. So, that's why you want to save your, um... That's why you want to manage your health chests. You see what I mean? Because if I had eaten... Oh, if I had taken the health chest before now, I would still have lost about a little over half... Or a health bar and a half or so. So that's why you really want to manage your health chests. And if worse comes to worse, you can just use a healing item, because healing items are actually fairly cheap in the long run. Um, I, it's going to sound crazy, but a healing item that'll heal you for about four uh, life stones is only about 500 souls. So, yeah. There's nothing wrong with needing to use one of those, because, well, that's what they're there for. Because I have no illusions. I'm not some super mega awesome pro. I just say that because I'm an asshole. You know, I just say that because I'm, you know, because I'm stupid. I'm not the best gamer at this. Like, I'm not the best uh, player of Darksiders. Like, hell. I've seen someone post a speed run of this game on YouTube. Like, when I was looking up videos for it to help me find some stuff. Um, I saw someone that had posted a speed run and they. Oh my god, stop with the lag, please. Uh, they beat the entire game in an hour. The whole game in an hour. I don't even know how that's possible. Wait a minute. I thought I... Oh my god, I missed the health chest in the, jewel, in the jailer room. Oh well. Welp, gonna have to deal with it now. This is where I prove that I am Super MLG Pro. Oh my god. I just want to use the delay. Oh, close. Come on, die already. There we go, good. I don't care that that guy's over there. I just want to kill his little cronies first. Because I can deal with him easily. It's the potential to get hit by everybody else that's making me worried. Okay, he's dead? Good. And nothing but money from him. Good. Because I don't need wrath. Not really. Because I have a wrath chest available over there. And a health chest. Oh, not one of you. Come on. Okay, I just need to be careful here. Okay. No. Ow, what the hell was that? Good. Not too bad. Okay. Aha. I love it when you does the actual cutscene for that. Hey, Bloodthirst, do you want to actually do something for me here? That'd be great. <laughs> But then again, if the, if Bloodthirst was too overpowered, then, well, it'd be too overpowered. Okay, now I believe there's two more. Maybe they only come up when I grab the sword. That's probably what it is. Alright, let's go and grab it. Shing! Yep, 
Two big ice skeletons. Whoop, yeah, I don't. Ha! Ah. Ow, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm gonna use the health chest. Don't care. Because that's what it's here for. Yeah, it's like, ah. It's like, it's a health chest in the other room or a health chest in this room. It doesn't really matter. Woo. Come on, there we go. Sometimes it's kind of annoying to do this attack. Because it's like when you delay, sometimes it doesn't register enough of a delay. Or sometimes you just stop your whole attack altogether because you wait too long on accident, which is a real pain in the ass. No, I'm not. I'm kicking you guys' ass. Do the attack. I hate you. Here we go. There. Perfect. Well, not perfect, but you know what I mean. Alright, I'll go ahead and grab the wrath chest, because why not? Not doing anything else with it, so may as well just refill. Yay. And I'm pretty sure wrath chests fully refill all your wrath, like no matter how much you have. So, yeah. But okay, we are all done. Pretty much. All we gotta do now is just leave. We gotta just put this sword in the angel, and then we'll be right in front of the boss, and it'll be ready to fight. So yeah, we're pretty much done with the dungeon. Not too bad, if I do say so myself. Alright. All except for me forgetting that health chest. That was pretty stupid, but oh well, it's okay. Didn't really amount to anything, so whatever. Okay, so gotta go through here now. Yeah, yeah, make your sounds. Try to be all spooky and scary. Spooky, scary skeletons. Do, 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 do. Alright. I don't remember the lyrics that song. All right. Oh, now, okay, there's a health chest down here, if you want it. Uh, it's right over there, which I'm actually going to go and grab it, because, well, why not? Whee! Ow. All right. Woo! So, let's go ahead and put the sword. Yeah! And lag again. For some weird reason, I'm lagging in this dungeon. I don't know why. I'm not playing on Xbox Live or anything. Huh, my gauntlet is pretty cool, huh? Come on! Yay! Okay! So, we're all done. And now, that's the, uh, the boss room there, so if I go through there, we'll be able to go up and fight the boss. But we're not doing that yet. Now, are we in the correct room? Yes, we are. Perfect. Okay. So this is pretty much the only thing in the dungeon that we're really missing, aside from one other thing, if I remember right. It's on the opposite side, uh, which I'm going to be trying to get. So, use the crossblade, hit him, walk right under. That's all there is to it. And then you can come in here, and you get three chests. This, up here, and it is a piece of the Abyssal Armor. It's number three. <laughs> Jump down here, and you can get uh, some cash. And right here, this is very important. This is an entire Wrath Core. That's an entire core. That wasn't a shard, it's a core. So you can get an, that's an entire Wrath attack just from that. So be sure, whoops, be sure you get that. Damn it, I hate those things. Uh, and I'm going to be, I'm going to real quick head on over this way, and I want to get this other thing. Because there's yet another item. Okay. So I hope I can climb straight up there. I don't have to go through the room. I think I got to go through the room. But yeah, you see right there, we got to have the crossblade to break that. So, we got to go over here. I'm going to uh, run up there and grab that, and then we're going to be done. And next time, we're going to head on up to the boss, because it's time to leave. 
Now, I believe this item up here is basically just if you want to do 100%, but because I'm going to be trying to do that, I may as well just grab it now, and I'll have it uh, available. Just in case I missed anything, I'll at least know where everything is. Because only just now do they give you Horde Seeker. This is Horde Seeker over here. The thing that shows you where the chests are, this is Horde Seeker. So, break that, fly on over here, and then over there, that's Horde Seeker. I don't know why they wait so long to give this to you. You can't possibly get this without going through the whole dungeon. Horde Seeker. Because there's no bombs down there. It's bullshit. Alright, but anyway, uh, let's see here. So, Horde Seeker shows you where all the chests are. There's one, wait, there's one there. Huh? I'm going in there. Uh, it's behind me, so it's in here. How is there a chest in there? Oh, wait a minute. I know what that is. It's a health chest. Because you come in here and health chest, so I don't need that. But yeah, if I end up missing anything, uh, I will come back and check. Don't worry. Um, I'm going to be looking it up. Uh, you don't need to worry about letting me know where stuff is because I'm going to be looking it up after the fact. Like, once we get to like the tail 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 end of the game I'm gonna be looking it up and then going back and getting everything so yeah so we have unlocked the boss of the Twilight Cathedral so next time on Darksiders we're gonna go in and kick her ass so see you then